In our worldview today, COVID-19 deaths in Brazil are on track to surpass the worst wave the U.S. saw back in January. The country set another single day record for deaths on Tuesday with nearly 4,200 people killed. Roughly 340,000 have died from the virus so far, but health experts say overall deaths in Brazil could exceed the number in the U.S. Despite Brazil having a smaller population, President Jair Bolsonaro has repeatedly resisted calls for tighter restrictions and dismissed mask wearing and the efficacy of vaccines. Despite the surge, the economy minister has insisted the country can be back to business in two to three months. European authorities say they have found a link between AstraZeneca's COVID-19 vaccine and rare blood clots found in patients who received the shot. That announcement came down from the European Medicines Agency within the last hour or so. The concerns around the vaccines have already prompted more than a dozen countries, including Germany and France, to suspend the use of the vaccine to younger people. European health ministers plan to hold a meeting later today to discuss how to move forward with the vaccine rollouts. And over in Japan, concerns about coronavirus infections have derailed the Olympic torch relay yet again. The governor of Osaka canceled the upcoming event Wednesday amid a surge in virus cases in Western Japan. Torch bearers will no longer run through public streets, but they will instead hold the rally behind closed doors next week. The Tokyo Summer Games are set to begin on July 23rd after a year long delay, but the organizing committee's already banned foreign visitors from attending to avoid any outbreaks.